That kind of a big accomplishment from where the program was maybe before you got there. Is that something that you guys kind of are, are proud of and kind of hanging? We're, we're extremely on? proud of. You know, we hadn't uh, this program hadn't been to a bowl game in quite some time, and uh, from where we began um, to where we are today, we're, we're we're very proud to go to our third consecutive bowl game. Um, I sometimes reflect back on our tenure here and. I kicked myself a little bit the first year. We probably should have went to a bowl game that year too, but we made some mistakes late in ball games on the road that ultimately cost us that opportunity. But for us to have uh, you know, won the Holiday Bowl two years ago, um, competed at a very high level against Baylor and RG3 last year in the Alamo Bowl, and now to represent our conference uh, in the Vegas Bowl against Boise State, I, I think is something that our entire football team should be proud of, especially our, our veterans, our seniors. You mentioned the, the wild bowl game last year and how obviously you'd rather come off a 13-10 win than a 67-56 loss. But when you look back on that, is that all you think about is the loss or do you think like I mean, in the moment, was that kind of a, a fun it, thing to be a part of? It was a great or? game, I have to admit. I mean, I, I sure wish we would have won it. Um, but I, I, you know, from a fan's perspective, it was obviously a very exciting game. Uh, it was an exhausting one. I think we're all a little tired by the end of it. But, uh, you know, it was, it was, a, it was a, two really good football teams that were playing at a high level offensively two quarterbacks that were playing about as good as football as you could have played and um, you know it was a fun one to be part of I know I know the, the ESPN loved it because they got pretty good ratings out of it general maybe they asked us all right we just kind of practice in here and how that's this has worked out for you I thought it's gone well um, the transition has been great obviously Bishop Gorman has a fantastic facility um, and one that is kind of a one-stop shop for us from the locker room to the weight room obviously the practice facility and all that so um, it's it's worked out great, and I, I think the guys are, are having fun with it. In Pac-12 teams been Bryson at UNLV. Did, did, did you look at UNLV? We did. It, just from an accommodation standpoint, um, with the lack of the locker room and things, it, it got a little bit difficult with the hotel and then and then traveling with their pads and all that. This was a lot easier from an efficiency standpoint of just coming here and being able to you know get the locker room, the weight room, the field, all that at one at one spot.